the murky waters of the 100 million US dollar Zimbabwe Electoral Commission ZC tender scandal have deepened with the emergence of a leaked audio recording, revealing a heated dispute between controversial tycoon Wicknell Chevale and his former business associate, Mike Chamon. The audio, which has been circulating in hushed tones across the capital, sheds light on the bitter fallout between the two men, a fallout that appears to have been triggered by the flow of money from the controversial deal. The deal, signed in February 2023 just before the August general elections, involved the supply of election materials by South African printing company Renform. Chevelle, Jamal, and Moses Mpofa acted as intermediaries in the arrangement, and the initial payments, which began in March, appear to have ignited the conflict. In yet another leaked audio, Chevelle, who was in Namibia at the time, can be heard rebuking Chimam for the numerous missed calls on his phone, relating to the deal. He warns Chimam not to interfere with his other business ventures, boasting of deals that his associates are unaware of. I have other deals that my friends know nothing about, Chiveo is heard saying. Don't try to stop them. Chimam, in response, accuses Chiveo of lacking communication in business dealings and insists that they had signed a $17 million agreement, adding fuel to the already simmering dispute. The audio recording, which has been verified by the Newshawks, provides a chilling glimpse into the underbelly of the ZC tender scandal. It exposes the cutthroat nature of the deal, where greed and betrayal appear to have taken precedence over any semblance of ethical conduct. This latest development comes on the heels of another damning audio recording, which surfaced last month, in which Chiveo boasts of his close relationship with President Emerson Umingagua and details payments made to several high-ranking officials, including ZC Chair Priscilla Chigumba, CIO Director General Isaac Moyo, and gold magnate Pedzese, Scott Sakapwanya. The Zimbabwe Anti-Corruption Commission ZCC has reportedly launched an investigation into the trio. Chiveo, Chimam, and Pofu, on charges of fraud and money laundering. However, the political system appears to be protecting Chiveo, who enjoys close ties to President Umingagwa and other key players in the deal. Chimam and Pofu, on the other hand, are currently in jail on fraud charges stemming from the 88 million US dollar presidential votes scheme. Chiveo, who has amassed a fortune from government contracts, has been on the defensive since the first audio recording emerged. He initially denied that the voice on the recording was his, but later issued a lengthy apology to President Mingagwa. His wife, CIO Director General Isaac Moyle, Chief Cabinet Secretary Martin Rushwaya, and ZC Chairperson Justice Priscilla Chigumba, for the adverse impression, created that these officials were involved in corruption. In response to the allegations, presidential spokesperson George Karamba, in a statement posted on X, dismissed Chaveo's claims as offensive name-dropping that did not automatically indict the president and government. He asserted that claims don't become true because they have been made or because some detractors of the president, in chorus form, wish them to be so. The ZC tender scandal has cast a long shadow over Zimbabwean politics, raising serious concerns about the integrity of the electoral process. The leaked audio recordings, coupled with the ongoing ZCC investigation, have intensified scrutiny of the deal and its players, potentially leading to further revelations that could shake the foundations of the ruling party.